And then there is the long form of the verb quieti. We make the long form by adding HO, HO before the short form. So CHU becomes HO CHU and then CHESH, HO CHESH, HO CHE and then plural CHEMO, HO CHEMO, HO CHETE and the third person plural Hoche. Remember that third person plural and singular have exactly the same form. So just adding ho 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 to the short form. The long form we use just like with the long form of the verb piti to make questions. So ho chuli kuhati, will I cook? Ho chuli kuhati. And to answer this question, yes, I will, you could just say, Hochu. Yes, I will. So it's all these words are, let's say, built in this one word. Hochu li kuhati, hochu. Hochu li jesti. Or hochu li učiti. Hoche. Or the, for the plural, hochemo li šetati? Hochemo. Yes, we will. Hochete li pjevati? Will you all sing? Will you guys sing? And then, hoche li doči? Will they uh, come? Will they arrive? So the long form we use to make questions, adding li, don't forget li, li is there. Um, place right after the long form of the verb kieti and we always use li in yes or no questions and we also use the long form to give a single word answer